welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl, JVB. How are you guys doing today? First and foremost, as always, thank you so much for being here on my channel, checking out my reactions as well as my own music. In the description below, you're going to find all the links. Guys, it's been a minute, Nightwish, they've been touring and they actually announced that they are going to stop touring. They need a break and I want to say that as sad as it is, I am kind of happy that bands take what's best for them because Flo Janssen, um, I don't know if you saw one of her posts, um, she collapsed and she had to be brought to the hospital. Thankfully, her baby is okay and she's okay. Sometimes bands forget they're humans too. And, you know, we fans, we love them and we want to watch them. I get all of that. But and, and as a musician, you feel so responsible. You want to play, you want to be with your fans, but you also sometimes need to take some time off and take care of your own mental health and well-being because touring, as fun as it is, it is also super stressful. It's a very different lifestyle. You know, that's not, um, it's, it's not always the way you want it to go. There's a lot of stress going on and everybody has a, a life, you know, and when you're on tour, you really don't have a life. So I completely understand why they are doing that so i wish you the best night wish but i do wanted to do a reaction that i saw um that was just uh posted a few weeks ago uh noise live with uh floor being pregnant and i wanted to do the reaction because i love night wish so so much and i encourage you all to continue supporting Nightwish. Just because they're not playing doesn't mean you can't support them by their merch. You know, go comment on their posts, on their on their YouTube posts, on their social media posts, um, like their content, subscribe to their channels, and just support them. Show your support, you know, and I will do the same here on my channel. I love Nightwish. It's one of my favorite bands on this channel, and I will always support Nightwish. And Flo Janssen, I wish you the best, and I wish you well, and I look forward to seeing you having your second baby healthy and happy and taking some time to raise your kid and to have some family time. You well deserve it. You've done a lot in the past few months. You know what I mean? Um, so with no further ado, let's get straight into it. Nightwish Noise Live. Here we go. So that's a long intro. Um, so I may skip this. Let's see. Can we really skip this? But yes, we wish um, Nightwish nothing but the best. Building the suspense. It feels weird to see snow right now while I'm sweating in my studio with my shitty headphones. Nightwish is so good with intros and I love when bands do that. Another band that always does amazing intros is Typo Negative. I'm like, come on. Don't make me wait here in my home. <laughs> Building the tension. And I can't have 
have my fan on. I don't want to have the fan on. Yes, here we go. Digging the lights. I'm digging the fire. Yes, 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 yes. Those two for the double jump. Double bass. Noise is one of my favorite songs, by the way. I just love the music video. Crowd getting them all ready. Playing concerts during the day is always hard you now because it's, just, it's harder. Look at all the <laughs> all the pyro going up already. There they are, Troy, Thomas. Yeah. There she is, Queen. Well, can we just like acknowledge how badass Flo Janssen is? I mean, look how pregnant she is and she is still performing. And yes, we know that she collapsed and, and you know, that is so sad. And man, <laughs> she's such a hard worker. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is just so crazy to me um, that she still does it because she's so dedicated to her fans the whole band is so dedicated you know and I know that they're also grateful that she was still there doing that um but that takes a lot that takes so much and her voice sounds amazing
voice sounds so powerful. This woman is highly pregnant. You know what I mean? It's got to be so uncomfortable. And she's singing her heart out. She is so committed always. This woman is such a show woman, this whole band. You know what I mean? Um, and honestly, I would have told her, do not even like tour at this point anymore. But she does anyway, because that's just how she's built. That's how what she does, right? So dedicated, like I said before. But her voice sounds so powerful, as always. And part of that is when you are a touring musician, when you're a singer, and you have great technique, your voice will get better and better and better the more you do it. Because what you're doing is just like you would be doing yoga, right? You keep doing, you're working your muscles, you're stretching. You really, if you have proper good technique, then you get just stronger and better. I love, when I was touring, I was really afraid I would lose my voice. And it I didn't. Because when you have good technique, and you're really singing like fully holistically, your voice will get stronger and stronger. And that you do have to have days off, obviously, you know, and it can happen easily that you get hoarse. But oh my God, it's like raining, by the way, and like thunder. But um, I just wanted to bring that up because it is like proven that your voice gets stronger, but you have to have good technique. And she obviously does, you know, she's very, very skilled and she knows what she's doing a hundred percent. But the whole band, I just always love watching Nightwish because besides being fantastic musicians, they have such great showmanship and they always have fun on stage. Look at them. They're all like laughing. They're smiling. They're having a good time. <laughs> In the best possible way. Look at Tuoma, that'd be so much fun, it's sure. Of course she said banging, why wouldn't she? That baby's gonna be so metal. Which reminds me how badass the song is, you know what I mean? It's just like so many different elements in there. And here you can hear, or I should say you can see, you can't really hear it, but you can see that Flora is not 100% hearing herself, so she is checking her in-ear monitors, um, but she's still on point, you know, because she knows the song, she knows the music, and that is so important when you are a singer and you have pitch issues. I used to have major pitch issues. I would actually be afraid of certain songs because like I knew like certain songs of mine. I wrote them, but I, I would like sometimes something would throw me off because a little frequency can really throw you off no matter how well you know the song. But my point is, if you know your song 100% like really, really well and you've been well rehearsed, chances are that you will be on pitch even if you cannot 100% hear yourself. However, it is easy for a frequency to throw you off. So for her to not, you know, be 100% like sure if she, if she hears everything, she's still so on point and that is so Flo Janssen. She's such a pro. Check, go back here. And also this song, by the way, I re I'm 
it's been a minute since I listened to that song and I remember now I'm like oh my god that song has like so many cool parts to it you know it's it's very commercially available first of all because the hook I mean but every almost every song of that Nightwish has is like very oh Baldy are you scared is there thunder out there oh no my bald is like freaking out right now because it's thunder come here baby come here honey um but come here baby oh <laughs> But um, the point is that when you know a song really well, it's going to be easier. But also what I was going to say is like, Bolt is like, my Bolt is like so scared of the thunder. He gets really, really scared. Um, but the song is so intricate and so fun because there's so many different parts. And it's all the songs are very hooky, but especially this song really stuck out to me because it's just so good. It's such a meaningful lyrics and also amazing composition. So definitely make sure that you go back and listen to the whole song fully to really study like the structure of the song. It's very, very commercially available, but still so, so Nightwish because there's so many artsy parts in it and intricate parts like this one. Right <laughs> I love this part so much. It is so theatrical. Right there, she's like, oh, okay, I can't hear myself. But she's so on point. Mad respect, mad respect, that's all I gotta say, so much respect, so much respect for Nightwish, for Floor Janssen, for doing this concert while being super pregnant, that's all I'm gonna say, um, I wish Floor Janssen the best and I want you all right now, after watching this, to go on the YouTube to go on their social media and just wish them well and and tell them that it's okay for them to take a break and that we will always be there for them when they are coming back refreshed and renewed taking a little time off can do wonders and like I said earlier touring can be super hard on a band and you know everybody is is in different uh, in different on different stages in their life so taking a little break is a healthy thing and we have to um you know accept that and be okay with that we will always support nightwish no matter what and i wish Flo Janssen the best and a healthy baby and some quality time the whole band some quality time with their loved ones their family and also probably some alone time which sometimes you really need after a tour um 
you know, because it does get a little bit hectic and stressful. So with that said, I'm going to let you guys go. And as always, in the comments below, let me know what you thought of this. Is Flo Janssen just a badass for doing this? Oh my God. Like part of me wants to be like, don't do it. Don't even do it. You know, just take off. But she, like I said, she just loves doing this so much and she wants to be there for the, for her fans and she knows how much we love and adore them. And I know it was heartbreaking for her to even post it and say, I cannot play any more shows. So yeah, in the comments below, let me know what you thought of this performance and what you think about um, Nightwish taking a little break. Let me know what should be the next Nightwish reaction um, and all. Uh, also, Flo Janssen, I, ha I have to do more of her solo uh, music as well because it's so beautiful. It's so awesome. And she's been just like doing so, so much. So I have mad respect for that woman and for that band because the songwriting, the live performances are just so amazing. And as a, as a vocal performance coach, you know, it's all about how you perform a song live and how you translate something that has been recorded, you know, um, onto the stage and really amazing bands do an, an amazing job where no matter how they transform the song, which, you know, I think it's awesome and bands don't always play the song exactly the way it is on the record because that's the beauty and magic of a live performance. Um, so it's, it's the, that's what you can really tell. You know, the sign of a good band is when they put, in, put on an amazing, engaging mesmerizing live show. So with that said, I'm going to let you go. I'm going to leave you with something uplifting and positive. Make every day a great day. And just remember, we're all human. So forgive and be forgiven. When you forgive someone, it's never for the other person. It is always for you. Because forgiveness, if you are holding a grudge, it's like eating poison, expecting the other one to die. And they're not gonna because you're eating the poison. So let anything that has been bothering you, just let it go for the sake of your own health, your own mental and physical health. It is not worth it to hold a grudge. Forgiving someone doesn't mean forgetting. You know what I mean? You don't have to be friends with a certain person that really did you wrong or hurt you. Um, but you can forgive them to let that go and to not have that negative energy nagging at you constantly to have that negative energy constantly coming up bothering you just let it go write it down on a piece of paper have a conversation talk it out and if you don't want to do that just write it on a piece of paper or just like sing a song about it write a poem about it make some art about it take care of your mental and physical well-being and i'm going to see you in the next reaction much love as always Hit the subscribe button, the like button, the notification bell so you'll never miss a post of mine. And also check out my own music. I love your support. My birthday is coming up. So if you want, I have a little wish list um, in the description below. I would love some surprises. Um, as always, I love you guys and I appreciate what you do. And I will be here for you in the long run. So I'm going to see you in the next one. Take care.